channel my name is Emily for you all that do not know me um, today I'm coming to you with a curly hair review now this hair that I have in my head is a wig that I made it is made with a closure um, you've got the inches um, with the longer starting at 28 26 24 and 22 inches and separately I ordered a 28 inch closure and the texture of this hair is Indian Indian deep curly this hair oh my god this hair is amazing I'm coming to you six months later I got this hair in February of this year and this hair has been bomb like this hair right now in this natural state that it's in right now it's been three days I haven't put any product in it I haven't actually did an actual wash on this hair and maybe I would say a month because I had just had maybe a month and a half ago I did have full locks on my hair so I just have put this up in the closet and I just pulled it back out and put some product on it and here I am three days later with it just like this so the hair is perfect it's honestly very minimal like work that you have to do to it if anything if you want it to look real good and not like frizzy or not poofy all you have to do is wet it put some conditioner on it put in a leave-in conditioner anything curl cream anything like I put whatever is around whatever I see first is what I put in it with water yeah, one of the cons I will say is that I mean which is probably what happens to any hair it probably what happen to your own hair um, if I don't wash it and I just keep wetting it and I just keep it adding product to it and I don't clean the hair then it does get matted at the nape of the neck I would say that but other than that I have no problems as far as with the bundles period but the closure I definitely would say that the closure I have a pro and a con with the closure now the closure itself is beautiful like when I say it, it just lays so flat it's just like perfect it looks so natural like it's just it's amazing I love the closure I love the DY hair's closures like I can say that they're the most natural closures I've ever seen like and this is a wig and usually they're bulky but this one it just lays so flat it just looks so natural it feels like it feels and looks like it's just coming right out of my scalp but the con is it sheds so bad like you will definitely have ball spots if you bleach the knots you will definitely have ball spots so only and if you wash your hair a lot expect your closure to maybe you may can get away with a month with the closure that's like the one thing um, it's the hair will still look nice like your bundles that you have will still look nice so if you have a wig I honestly suggest that you just order another closure and honestly that wig will look brand new like it'll look like you got a whole brand new wig just by replacing the closure on it because the bundle hair the curls stay beautiful it doesn't get matted it doesn't get frizzy and then I feel like the hair on the closure texture wise is definitely different but it's still very beautiful like the hair is so beautiful when I say I get so many compliments on this hair like oh my god people are just stopping me oh my god where did you get your hair from da, da, da. and I just be like DYR 777 and they be like what and I just be like yeah because at first I had never knew who this company was but I did my research back in I'm gonna say 2000 and 15 I believe 2015 I started doing a lot of research watching a lot of YouTube videos I got some negative got some positive and I, was, I just went ahead with it this isn't my first time ordering from DY hair 777 I ordered from them previously and I ordered this actual same curly hair this same curly hair but in shorter lengths and I ended up cutting it into a bob and that hair was my holy grail hair that hair that wig lasted me for two years I actually still have that wig I actually still wear that wig and that hair is amazing I ordered that in January of 2015 and look at it now it is what 2017 July and it's July about to be August so and that hair is just beautiful so and it's the same texture deep curly and then deep curly I believe this yeah both hairs and then deep curly and I did dye both of them. I did dye both of them black. Wig, I don't even condition it. This wig, I may wash once a month. This wig has been with me everywhere. It gets packed up in suitcases, packed, bought up, put, squeezed in duffel bags. It's been thrown everywhere. As soon as I come home, I just throw it to the nearest spot it can go to. I don't put it up on a mannequin head. I don't do nothing. I even could go to sleep in this. And wake up looking flawless like <laughs> I'm telling you like this hair is amazing 
and I'm not even, I purchased this hair with my own money. Purchased hair with my own money. I'm not even sponsored. They haven't even talked to me. I haven't even talked to them. Honestly, this is a real personal, real opinion about this hair. And I'm telling you. I even get compliments from people with hair this texture asking me, what product do you use on your hair? And I'm just like, honey, this is just a wig, baby. I ain't putting nothing on this in three days. So, I'm telling y'all, this hair is amazing. I wouldn't steer you wrong. Honestly, me, I'm I'm just like you. Like, I'm a YouTube watcher. I'm a YouTube fan. I watch people's videos. I try to find out, okay, what's the best hair to get. I do research. I watch videos for weeks and weeks at a time before I decide to order hair. So, I'm just like you. I read the reviews just like everybody else. I'm out here. I bought this hair on a whim as a regular customer. Paid with my own money. And honestly, the hair is really beautiful. I really don't regret getting the hair. Like, this hair, six months later, post three days of putting product, not even a full wash. I'm telling you. Step up in this bitch like...